Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. The Audi e-tron GT, originally introduced in 2021, is about to receive its mid-life cycle update, following the example of the closely related Porsche Taycan. Before the debut of the facelifted model, Audi showed a prototype, previewing the mild exterior tweaks. More important upgrades are expected under the skin, including stronger electric motors, faster charging capabilities, a more sophisticated active suspension system, and the addition of a new RS Performance flagship trim. The Audi e-tron GT prototype, shown in the official photos, doesn't wear any kind of camouflage, with the fancy livery being the only thing that differentiates it from the final production model. The EV looks instantly recognizable, but a closer look reveals a few changes over the current RS e-tron GT. The front bumper sports revised intercase and a slightly different grille cover, while the tail features a redesigned diffuser. Finally, the model rides on a new set of aero-optimized alloy wheels, finished in black. Besides sharing revealing photos of the Audi e-tron GT prototype next to the Ducati Panigale V4R Superbike, the automaker didn't get into specifics about the mechanical and technological upgrades which are expected to be more significant. Judging from the recently updated Porsche Taycan, the Audi e-tron GT will come fitted with more powerful electric motors and offer a faster charging rate of up to 320 kilowatts per hour instead of 270 kilowatts per hour. Some trims might also get the larger capacity, 105 kilowatts per hour battery pack, offering a greater range compared to the existing 93.4 kilowatt unit. The facelifted lineup will be crowned by a new RS Performance flagship set to produce more than the 637 horsepower, 475 kilowatts, of the outgoing RS e-tron GT, but less than the 939 horsepower, 700 kilowatts are, of the new Porsche Taycan Turbo S. Another highlight is a new active suspension system with hydraulic actuators, similar to the Porsche Active Ride. This will allow Audi engineers to further enhance the comfort driving dynamics of the electric model. Jan Matis Reiling, technical project manager of the Audi e-tron GT said, the improved suspension system introduces new adjustment capabilities for the driver, hinting at a wider spectrum of drive modes and settings. Audi didn't give us a date for the debut of the updated e-tron, GT family, which is expected sometime in the coming weeks, months. Friends, write in the comments what you think about the new 2025 Audi e-tron GT. It's interesting to know your opinion. Put likes and subscribe to the channel so as not to miss the latest news from the world of cars.